to play some Willow. And this will kind of be a two-in-one showcase. It'll be a showcase of the buffs she got this patch, but also the buffs she got... It was either last patch or two patches ago. She got a very nice quality of life thing that I've been asking for for a while, so it made me very happy to see it. But uh, she basically got the functionality of her ultimate now just reloads her ammo. So before, for years on end, basically since release, if you started your ultimate with, like, five ammo, you would end your ultimate with five ammo, and you just have to reload after you ult, which is nice. really frustrating. Hello, so that's been fixed. And then also now this patch, that is combined with a general uh, seedling buff, where the seedling has a two-second reduced cooldown, so from 15 seconds down to 13 seconds. And then also, also she gets one extra ammo, which is really just for quality of life. It feels really nice. So we're going to combine all that, and hopefully we won't get super farmed here. I only just now realized that we have a pro circuit player on the enemy team, so that's a bit intimidating, but they're on Grover, so... Not like they're playing DPS. And honestly, I'm half tempted to play Scorn here purely for the sake of showing off Seedling. Uh, we could do multiple Willow matches here, actually. Play a Scorn and then play Blastflower. I feel like the sensible talent here is still Blastflower. I don't know. Chat, tell me. What do you want to see? Do you want to see Scorn, or do you want to see Blastflower? I will play what chat decides. But you gotta be fast, because we got like 30 seconds here. The battle is about to begin! We got one for Scorn. Anyone else? Anyone else? I'll drink my peach tea. We got one for Blastflower. One for Scorn. Three for Scorn, four for Scorn. Okay, I'm seeing a lot more Scorn. Let's do Scorn, then. Five, Please don't four, try hard too hard, enemy three, team. <laughs> two, I'm gonna grab some Kronos as well. We're really gonna push this to the max. So play it like you normally would with Scorn. So yeah, let's try this out. The buff basically makes it so that with Scorn, you're gonna need to hit one fewer enemy to get a uh, full cooldown on set. Which is certainly a nice quality of life feature. And for the other playstyles, basically just means that, yeah, you get some... Um, you, know, you just get more seedlings. It, it's, you know, they're ultimately never super impactful, but they do help. But yeah, of course I'm playing Scorn, so I'm not going to be doing much damage with my primary attacks. Look at that reset, though. Oh my goodness, that was a big amount of damage. I'm going to throw another seedling back here. Hopefully rebound and hit some people. Yep, there we go. Yeah, look at that spam. It's just a little bit faster now. Also, I guess I can remind you of the build. We're running uh, Sprouts 5, which is the main source of, source of Gloom Reduction. But then we're also running Just Believe, so when I get an elimination, it basically finishes off the deal and I get my Scorn back instantly. So, very helpful. You've made my day. And yeah, we just grazed that Grover a little bit, but we still get our Scorn back. It's a little bit faster. It's all just faster now. Feels good. Also, I gotta say this every time I play Willow. I I love this skin so much. I, this skin brings me happiness. <laughs> The, the effects are just top-notch. These are some of the best VFX in the game, if you ask me. And I am totally biased as a sucker for purple. This is how you do purple effects right. Like, look at those. Look at those primary shots. Oh. Gorgeous, man. But yeah, I guess, um, you know what? We're low on ammo. I'm about to get a... one of these back. Let's do this. I'm gonna ult and showcase how we get our ammo back at the end of this ultimate, assuming I don't die. <laughs> do the longest-range dogfight with Drogus. I think I'm just better shooting at the guys down here. But yeah, boom, my ult ends, and I'm back to 9 ammo. Just a super simple quality of life buff that I've been asking for, and I'm so happy is a thing. Ooh, big damage on Makoa there. Oop, Void Grip. <laughs> for some reason, I hit him in Void Grip, and I only did 388 damage. That makes no sense. But there we go, evil amount of damage. Gonna take out Makoa. Hey, buddy. Here, take the seedling. There we go. And I got another seedling. Here we go, throw it out. This is very nice. I really like just simple quality of life changes like they've been giving to Willow, you know? A little bit faster cooldowns, a little bit more ammo, ammo after ult. Same thing with the Terminus, you know? Get your Shatterfall back after ultimate. It's just, it's fun quality of life changes like that that I really appreciate. More than a lot of other things, honestly. Can we get that Makoa with the scoring? Oh, we can! Let's go! Nice. Okay. Oh, <clears throat> this is pretty fun. Let's get Chronos Dose just really max out the spam. They really honestly need to do a bit of a better job of pressuring me. I'm not getting too much pressure from the Koga. Drogus is on the other side of the map constantly. So, yeah. I'm really just free to throw a bunch of seedlings. And I am pretty vulnerable with this build. With Blastflower, you get a build for max health, you get a build for damage reduction on Flutter. In this build, I have none of that. So, I have max health at 1. 
and I'm building for Kronos instead of Haven, so I'm generally just really squishy. So they can totally abuse that. That's the downside of playing Scorn, apart from the less reliable damage, of course. Uh, let's see, let's chuck a seedling back here, just see if it hits. Ooh, his aunt's pushing this way, okay. We got treble! We got treble! I got another seedling, though! And I got my ult, I'm just gonna throw that out. So this over here. Uh, it rebounded on the wall, whoops. There we go, gotcha. We'll see if Drogos can actually hit this shot here. Doesn't seem like it. Just gonna pop off on Willow real quick. <laughs> nice. Whee! That's basically a team wipe. Oh, Koga's back, and he's alone. Where do you think you're going? You're gonna ult me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Throw a seedling down. We got knocked away from the seedling. Hello. You like healing? Hope you don't. Why are you killing yourself in game? I'm not. Oh, uh, wait. Oh, I am. Never mind. <laughs> ah, he's so hard to hit. If only I had ult, I would go after him, but I don't. He'll be back. Ooh, I almost one-shot Koga there. He dies off that. Huge. Alright, he's gonna take a little bit of damage from that. We got the Genos heal. Gonna throw this back. Please do some damage. Okay, we got a little bit of reset. Up we go. Let's throw this down. Drogos is looking low. Dies to the enemy. Or uh, to our Drogos. Good. You know what? Risky play, but I'm using this to get out of here. There we go. Gotcha. I'm gonna throw this here. Oh, it doesn't do damage, though. Unlucky. Nice. Got another ceiling. I'll just throw it up there. There's no one alive, though. Oh, you know what? It hits Koga out of spawn. Alright, huge. And just like that, boom, another ceiling. This is really nice. Oh, man. I cannot hit these shots on his own. Just throw this down. I mean, okay, you're... You, dude, what are you doing? Okay. <laughs> um... Is that a new Drogo's voice line? Is what a new Drogo's voice line? I want to get a ceiling and just chuck it right at the Mako. There we go. This should be fat. That was decent. And I'm going to get another one. We can just throw that back. That was one. Nice, he died. Ooh, good Fernando ult there. Uh oh. I'm out of position. But it doesn't matter, Azan left the point, so we win. GG's. Allied Abyssal Drogo's ult. No, that's not new. That's always been there. Yeah, let's take a look at the stats here. Didn't quite get as many kills as Drogo's, but I never died. Again, they weren't really pressuring me that much. And Willow just feels good. She just feels really, really nice. Cumulative, just quality of life changes throughout the past two patches is really doing her wonders so very happy to see that and of course another good excuse to take out this legendary skin here absolutely love this skin